That's the sound I make every time I move my chair, by the way. It's me. Move my chair. There we go. Yep. Okay, thanks. Thank you for telling me that I went live over there when I know I went live over there because I just went live over there. Focus? No? You don't want to focus for me? Fucking shit stain on the fucking... Thank you. Now refocus. Maybe that's just out of focus. I wonder if I, I could put you on my other monitor and probably get a better angle. Probably almost the same. Hmm. Might have to try that. Might have to try that later. Anyway. So yesterday. It's not really focusing on my YouTube. It's kind of lame. But yesterday, that's what we did. I'm showing my YouTube. That's what we did uh, with the angler chick. Although this arm, again, looks like a goddamn linebacker, which I'm going to fix that real quick. Here's all I'm doing with that. I'm just going to smooth it out. I'm going to do a, a paint jobby. I'm going to go ahead and do a paint jobby. There, I'll just, I'll just bring her arm down. And then when I do a paint job, I'll just actually uh, paint over that. Woo. The excitement. Uh, really easy to paint over things. You know, paint. Hey, baby. <laughs> so, here's what I got to do first and foremost. Flip over those. Give them a shake. Flip them back over. Had to get my eraser out. Ew. Oh, what the? Ah. Yeah. No, it doesn't really smell like anything. Um, but it does have weird stuff on it. Hang on a minute. Let me just like sticky shit. Oh, why? Gross. Why does it have weird stuff on it? My eraser's half yellow. Yeah. Oh. All right. So anyway. My eraser's half yellow. My old, you can kind of, you know, good old, you want it? What, my old nasty eraser? I mean, yeah, you can have it, I guess, bro. Ooh, it's kind of sticky on this one side. No, no. Okay, anyway. But now, let me get rid of the, uh, the pencil marks from yesterday before I do an idea. Uh -huh, because, you know, art... Art with me is all about experimentation. But I have this idea because remember the uh, alcohol method, right? Uh, that I utilize usually. I don't use it as a painting method. However, I'm going to use it as a fucking painting method after I erase the, uh, the marks. Uh, so, yes, Wifels. I sniped somebody. Oh my God, you sniped somebody on Fortnite. Yes, I fucking did. I'm impressed. I got my first knife. Oh. My wife got her first snipe kill on Fortnite, apparently. Two bigger royals today for us, too, by the way. Yeah, row. I heard. In a row. I know. Congratulations. I couldn't even do that. I tried. Are you finishing that up? Working on it. Okay. Very important, by the way. Your eraser will get dirty very quickly. So uh, have something to rub it off on. Usually pants works good, but my shorts are a little very smooth textured. So I'm not sure it's all janky so it ain't gonna work but you don't want to have a a heavy amount of um carbon or whatever the hell your pencils carbonite i think that's what han solo was in you don't want to have a lot of han solo heavily on your eraser because it'll smear it and smudge it and you'll never get that shit off oh you want the picture of my eraser yeah i can draw a picture of my eraser for you bro that's cool it's really, I mean, it's not going to be that hard. It's like a square eraser, but it's yellow on one side. But I can do that for you, bro. Sure, no problem. Anyway, we're just going to uh, erase the shit out of all of that. Well, it's not even done yet, man. I'm still erasing some of it. And it's not even close to done. It might be a disaster before it's finished. You never know. So far... Most of the lines are going away. I definitely want them off of here before I do my idea of how I'm going to paint it, paint it. Um, but <laughs> it 
got to push hard to make sure you get, because keep in mind, canvas is not like paper. Paper, Fortnite, you Fortnite, my wife and my daughter, my, my daughter is like a fucking beast. She could, I mean, she's like pro, for real, like a pro champ of that. She's eight, and that kid can, I brag about her like every time. It's ridiculous. She is ridiculously good. Shit, you see that smear I just made? It caught it just crooked. Caught it just right and made a smudge. Yeah. So am I going to be able to get that pulled out good? I don't know. I hope so because I would rather have a pure white board than uh, and work with that than smudges and have to try to cover that up. It's easier to work with uh, clean slates than dirty ones that you have to cover up like that bullshit and that line there, which is acceptable because I chose to change that. Uh, this is going to be hard though here because I did this and then this is where most of my hand left a lot of the, uh, <sighs> So, you, so whenever I do paint that, that'll go over pretty good. And uh, what up, Greg? And uh, but I'm hoping to get a lot of that stupid graphite from my fingers because as an artiste, as an artiste, artist, you know, when you draw things in pencil, you get that smudge on your fingers. On your hand. That goes for lefties, righties, everybody's. Even, you know, I don't even know. If people don't even have arms, I imagine if they draw off their feet, they'd get toesies. You know, no, there are no fucking happy little mistakes. You're new to this, I guess. Uh, let me explain something to you, bro. Uh, here in, here in uh, anti-Bob Ross land, uh, my buddy Erica, actually, when we first started doing this, she dubbed me the anti-Bob Ross. She called me Rob Boss. And uh, she said that I don't make happy little accidents. I make angry fucking mistakes. Oh, speak of the devil. Here she is. And uh, yeah, she said I was the anti-Bob Ross. Uh, and that uh, I don't make happy little accidents. I make angry fucking mistakes. So that's what they are, man. They're angry fucking mistakes. They're not happy accidents. They're angry, pissed off fucking mistakes. And you gotta get, you gotta get angry with them back. You gotta be like, oh, get up in there tight really mean and aggressive make sure you get them out of that canvas because it's not like paper canvas will help those little cracks and crevices will help keep all that smudginess in there so when you're pulling out the mark or the pencil you gotta make sure uh -oh, you gotta make sure and get it out good that's how it works so i'm just like oh get up in there and be abusive to it don't worry, it will not call 911 on you. No uh, no domestics from your paintings. You know, so it's completely legal to take out abusiveness on uh, on your paintings, just not on your partners. That's how it works. You can abuse your paintings, not your partners. That should be one of my catchphrases, too. And, uh, you know, that looks all right. This is still a little bit marked up. I don't know if I'll be able to get that out because it's pretty deep right there. Let me try one more time. Oh, and there's some right here, too. Man, you fuck ass. All right, that ain't too shabby. Looking a little clearer. Looking a little... Looking, uh... Ha, 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 you're new. Yeah, the pencil course. Yeah, but, uh... Not too shabby. Again, did fuck that up, so when I paint it, uh, paint, paint. But I got a new idea, and Erica, uh, you know... The other day, because you know my method of uh, the alcohol method when it comes to this. Uh, well, when it comes to this, I thought about spraying it down and letting it do the usual thing. But ah, I got a new idea. Oh, good. It's so good. Uh, uh, it's good for, uh, good for growing hair on your chest. And then, you know, hair on your nipples. I have way too much hair on my nipples. They're disgusting. It's terrifying. My wife's like, ah, oh, every time I pull off my shirt, it freaks her out. She thinks there's some kind of spider monster coming out of my chest. And 
I'm like, no, no, it's not a bad sci-fi movie. It's just me shirtless again. What? I am dad. Thanks for noticing. Oh, God. All right. But. Yeah. Yes, sweetie. Are you going to play Rock, Paper, Scissors with me? No, I'm not going to play Rock, Paper, Scissors yeah, with you. I don't care. Yeah, no, I do not. I'm busy. Yeah, Can't down yeah. races. Yeah. I don't care. Yeah. Duda. A duda. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus yeah. Christ. Kids. Kids. Now, really quick, I just realized that I had a huge lack of detail up here really quick. And uh, so let me do that after I move this out of my way for just a second. So far, my YouTube seems to be holding strong today. Yesterday, we we ended up losing it for about like 45 minutes. And that sucked. Because I went on a huge rant. My usual rants. Uh, what the fuck are you doing? Rubbing the damn thing to death? Yeah, that's that's how I do it. That's how I work, girl. Mm. I rub it so hard. Mm, gotta rub it hard. Gotta get in all the nooks and crannies. Excuse me again, that soda gets me every time, and I, I burp on this all the time. I'm like, uh, bleh, bleh. I sound like some disgusting, gross dude. So a dude. And, uh, you know. But again, the beautiful method of, uh, the beautiful thing about scribble methods that I like to do is they look like you're detailing when you're not. <laughs> So people are like, oh, man, your detail works so great. How do you get that all in there? I'm like, like this. Like I'm having a fucking seizure or something while I got a pen in my hand. And people are like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, uh -uh. I, yeah, I have no technique. I just scribble around circle-y areas. And then I'm like, oh, yeah, there we go. Look, see? Oh, oh, oh. Some dots. Some dots. Oh, look. There's a few dots and a little bit of more shadow. Some dots. Some dots. You want to make that look a little bit more? Oh, some dots. Some dots. Little dots. And voila, the head looks a little bit more. Oh, well, you have to go finish your stuff. Fine. Hmm. Go finish your stuff. I got to finish my stuff, which is doodling. Anyway, so my ring thing here. My ring. Thanks for tuning in, though, bro. And uh, maybe if you ever get bored and... I feel like coming back by at some point, it'll be around. Catch up on the, uh, on the, uh, I do this like every day. Now it seems to be a reoccurring theme. So far, so good. So far, it hasn't been too shabby, I must admit. It's been all right. Um, where the fuck did my brown go? Mm. Anyway. Oh, here's two, the tail of two browns right here. Now, the other day, I had a pretty decent run with my brown and my yellow combination. Ooh, God. Ugh. My yellow now looks like poop. Looks like I just shoved that in my butt. And um, I did. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and give Mr. Uh, Bald Guy here some hair in brown. Now, here's what I'm deciding really quick before I go through this. I am going to give her some nips, um, but I am going to give them in a lighter color because <sighs> though it's all in black, which when I shade this in, will give it mostly purple shading and stuff um, if I use just the black. And the method I'm going to try here, you're cooking and cleaning the house. Gotcha. Well, you can leave this on and cook and clean and come back and see the progress. It's okay, bro. It's okay, bro. People do it all the time, and they listen to my craziness because we get into in deep conversations, man. Some in deep conversations. Yeah, I just posted a picture actually on my page about the uh, the space shuttle thing, and it blew my mind. But we'll get into that later. Um, but here's what I'm gonna do. I am going to actually take, and you don't know, Brandon. There, the uh, the other method that I use. I use. I invented a method of creativity using magic marker and alcohol. Uh, so when you take magic markers and you create something, it looks good, looks cool, whatever you hit it with alcohol, it just bleh, makes it all weird and bleh, like streaky and blobby and weird comes out strange and unique has a cool effect. 
However, uh, the last couple of attempts I've tried have done different things than I'm used to. So I'm trying to perfect my technique. You know, God damn it, I fucking love this. <laughs> but I'm trying to perfect my technique. However, today's experiment is I'm going to actually use... Go with me on this one. Yeah. These little guys, which I actually have for painting uh, some of my resin figurine things that I build. My little, like, well, you know, like when I build, when I hand carve those little guys and recreate those and stuff. But anyway, they have like uh, little stabby tips, right? So I'm actually going to try to basically create a paint brush method, if you will, by putting the alcohol in one of my caps, dipping it, and then using it to kind of spread it around and control the flow of alcohol, right, as a technique, if you will, and see if I can build up the coloration and the shading from that. And it'll either fuck this up or make it amazing. Don't know. But first I gotta give this guy some hair because it's like, you know, his head's really prominently popped off there. I just don't know how I want to give him hair. I just don't know how his hair should look. Like, I mean, he's like, ah, be nasty. So it's like, I don't know, bro. Like, how would your hair look if you were being, like, melted? I mean, it'd be obviously frizzle frazzed, but you'd have, like, a, like, a, Ah, oh, my hair. Oh, you're not going to have, like, good hair. I want him to have kind of some hair, like a little bit longer-ish hair, you know? Something like maybe he has a little bit of style to it. Something. I don't know. I'm not a hairologist. I don't draw hair often. Shit, most of my people are bald. Ken Ship and all that jibber-jab, man. So I don't want, I don't want no kind of bullshit. You guys leave, leave your negative comments about my hair alone, okay? Just, just you keep that off my page, yo. I know I'm bad at drawing hair. You just keep that to yourself. All right, now, here we go. Here we go. Look at this. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Got a little bit of hair going. A little bit of just frizzle frizz hair all over the goddamn place. Like, ah, my hair. Oh, oh fucking, that looks terrible. Looks like he put his fucking head in a goddamn blender. <sighs> fucking Jesus fucking goddamn fucking Christ. Oh, fucking mighty. You fucking thought hair would be easy. You put fucking hair on him. Oh, hair. Everybody needs fucking hair. Nobody needs fucking hair. Everybody should be fucking bald. You know why everybody should be bald? Because it's better. Make him look like Fabio. About to. <laughs> oh my god. Sorry, I probably blew your eardrums out. Oh no, I'm totally making him look like Fabio. With the yellow. Let's get that yellow up in there. Like we did the other day with some of our method with the yellow, smearing it around with the brown. Smeared it around brown town. <laughs> Poop. And uh, my yellow is still a little bit wore out. Oh, poor, poor yellow. Poor, poor fucking yellow. Yeah, that's pretty trashed. I think I accidentally destroyed this yellow the other day. Completely. But I am going to use it to kind of smear around the hair and see if I can add, like I said, the, the highlight kind of stuff like we did the other day. And bring it around. And, oh, that's actually coming out pretty decent now. Thank you. All right, yellow. Oh, you are such a fucking lifesaver, bro. Thank you, yellow. Watch. I'll show you what it looks like in a second, everybody. Hang on. Let me just kind of dedicate to the moment, okay? I know you didn't really get a good look at the travesty that was his fucking hair right before, but... That's not too shabby now. It's it's kind of all right-ish. 
I mean, it's it's not the best, but it's all right. Like, you know, like there. That's not too, too bad with the kind of blendingness. So somebody has the COVID. So anyway, why do you think I've been doing this for two fucking weeks? Lockdown sucks, bro. What would I do? Okay, so nipples are a little different because these colors are pretty fucking strong. That is a bright pink. Which, you know, bright pink nipples are hot. So, let me see if I got a lighter pink, though. Among this cake imposter update. I don't know what that even is. My dog still... Well, I know what the about or the Among Us thing is. That's another bright pink. That's fuchsia or something. Alright, this is kind of a real light pink color. So, I'm going to pull it... And maybe, oh, are you a lighter pink? Uh, you're a lighter pink, too. Okay. So let's try these three pinks together. All right? This is our light, light, sort of light, which I don't even know if they're draw if they're actually making color or not. Hang on a minute. Ugh, that's not this box. <sighs> Keep in mind, colorblind sucks, and my ability to see certain tones and stuff are even completely whack, so... <clears throat> Huh. I don't even think you're a pink, sir. I don't think that was actually a pink. It was more of an orange. Wow, you are dark. Okay, so we're going to try just this pink here. I mean, we, I'll probably use this one for a... Uh, anyone who is offended by nipples, please look away. I'm going to fuck these nipples up, aren't I? Oh my god, I am, aren't I? Dude, am I going to fuck the nipples up? I'm going to say something right now, and it's probably going to get really bad. I might get a lot of hate. Cardi B just accidentally released, accidentally released, on her uh, Snapchat or, I don't know, Twitter or Instagram, an un, uh, a not safe for work picture of her titties. And apparently, and I have seen them, they're... Um, not normally shaped, no, no. Uh, which you know, titties come in all shapes and sizes. I get that, but she apparently had boob job done at one point, and I think they fucked him up. She's getting a lot of hate for him. So here's my thing: as long as these titties don't come out like her titties, I think I'll be all right. Think outside the box with them. With her titties, what? Make them box titties? She's gonna have box titties. I'm gonna make square titties and shit. I'm kidding, Erica. I know what you're talking about. But I'm not going to go outside the box of the titties. Unless I have to. But I mean, this one's obviously in the pointed. And I had to make this one kind of up a little higher because this one's up pretty high. Indicating youthfulness, perkiness, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, which technically that's a hard line of a, of a boob, which indicates not. Um, in reality, this one would be much uh, lighter. It wouldn't be so defined of a line. You know, by indication, it would be more of a shadow that would indicate the uh, upward turn perkiness of it. So in a weird way, I kind of put both kinds of boobies there, like an older booby and a younger booby, you know, like youthful perky booby, older, mature, like probably had kids booby, you know. So kind of weird in that sense. But uh, just going to kind of pinking out the nipples here. Oh, yeah, 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 because I can kind of bring in a little bit of black and purple and a little bit. Okay, no biggie there. Let's just see. Because my other one would have to be about up like that-ish somewhere. Yeah, okay. And as of right now, all I'm really doing is just making them pink. Like a pink circle in the booby. No big deal. There, got boobies. <laughs> You give me a middle finger for what? Because <laughs> I was talking about, because I said the thing outside the box of it, and I was saying the booby thing, and like saying about uh, making them square boobies. Now, most boobies aren't like perfectly round. They have like bumps and things that go around them and things like that. So you can always just kind of, you know, tweak your boobies, tweak your boobies. 
a little bit with bumpies and stuff around to kind of give more of a realistic look. But we're not really painting movies right now. We're just kind of... Now, here's the rough part. This is what I'm not sure about. This is a little darker. By a little darker, I mean, that's the one that does this. You can see it on my skin. So my thing is, is if I go for a nip-nip here, okay, no, it's not too shabby. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's that's not too bad. There, it gives it more of a little. I mean, I could actually. Yeah. Boobies of cheese wheel holes? It would be cool as fuck. All right, you're officially invited to get the fuck out. And uh, cheese wheel holes? What the hell does that even mean, bro? <laughs> you're like, so I like titties with holes in them. I can grab them easier. I'm like, eh. and I don't know what kind of titties you're looking at, buddy, but they might need to go to the doctor for that. Hmm, a little bit. A little bit. But there's my titties so far. Not too looking too shabby. Little nipples. Little nipples. Not a big fan necessarily of giant aerolas. This myself. You know. Decent size. You know, again, boobies are all different. And people have different... Uh, drag them by the hold. <laughs> and people have different preferences for boobies. Just like people have different preferences for damn near everything. So... No hate on booby differences and alteration. Oh yeah, that's right. You're like a weird kind of kind of a weird pinkish tone. You might be cool for a skin highlight. Hmm. Mm hmm. But uh, yeah, I never I never hate on uh, this. Fuck. What if I do that and it looks like shit? Oh my god! Just do things, bro. Okay, let me get my alcohol. That's not my alcohol. That's my baby powder. I use baby powder for weird art stuff too. Where the fuck is my alcohol bottle? Hang on a second. Let me scoot up. Try not to. Not sure. Alcohol bottle? Oh, there it is. Got it. Okay. Anyway, so here's my plan. I just don't know. I just don't know if it's going to work. <coughs> Motherfucker, just you sit down there, ass cock. Okay. So I'm going to take a cap here from my bottle yesterday. Because I don't know how to throw things away. Uh, and I'm going to put some alcohol in it. Baby Jesus. Now, as we know, alcohol reacts, well, as you know, by watching my previous, which none of you here know, except for like two of you, alcohol reacts to um, uh, magic marker like a, uh, I have no funniness here, I have nothing. Anyway, it, acts, it, it does weird shit. Watch. I don't know how this is gonna work. Actually, fuck. No, hang on a minute. I fucked that up. You know what? I meant to do other things really quick. Hang on. Like for instance, I actually wanted to um, pinking out their gum lines a little bit. Hang on. Really quick before I continue with everything else. <laughs> That way I'll have some color in it, you know, a little bit more wacky do color throughout the. Oh, ugh, I just like. Ugh, oh, I did it again. <coughs> Why I do that? <coughs> oh God. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh, my wife did not marry me for my brains. That is for fucking certain. And she tells me that all the time too, so I know it's okay. And uh, she married me because I could move stoves and things by myself. That's all. All right, so we're just highlighting some stuff here, getting some 
weird meatish colors in here and there. And you know what? I might actually pull some of this around in and out throughout the whole thing just to kind of give it a little flare here and there of it. So as I'm coloring it, it'll kind of help highlight some of that. You'll see. You'll see. I know some of you that are in this with me sometimes knows what's up. You guys know my shit's fucking crazy. With all the detail you put in it, the alcohol scares me a little. No fuck, right? Like, what the fuck's going to happen now? It's going to be a disaster. That's why I'm going to try to pinpoint it. I'm fucking stupid. Erica, you know what's going to happen. Oh, you know what's going to fucking happen. Yeah, I got a feeling it's coming too. And uh, probably another one of those kind of episodes. But hopefully not. Hopefully not. Hopefully I don't fucking flip the fuck out on this one and it's all good. Again, hopefully. Y'all hope is important to have. See, looking good. A few little areas with some pink involved. Kind of help, hopefully, again, highlight a few things and keep a few things kind of similar. I'm going to keep that different. I'm actually going to... Maybe I should use that other color and see what it works out. Okay, all right, give me a second. You know, those nipples do look really good. Shit, I almost wish I had my camera. Oh, hey, Dad. I mean, hey, son. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Hello, son. That's what I said. Jeez. Anyway, I'm going to um, just put a little bit of pink around the gum line here. I don't know if everybody can see this all right. I'm kind of trying to... Ah, Jesus, I'm getting some of the, some of the black in there. Magic Marker, keep in mind, will also attempt to uh, blur with the other Magic Marker. You know what I mean? So you're always going to have it try to uh, blend in with the rest of it. Mm, that's okay, because we're going to take all that, and we are just going to punch it in its face in a minute with some booze. And by booze, I mean cleaning alcohol, not regular boozing alcohol, because I'm not an alcoholic. So I don't have booze on hand, but... Oh my gosh. Hang on. Give me a second. Anytime now you want to hurry up and finish, this would be great. Just add a little bit of color. So when I do this, it'll kind of give me some color to work with. There. She's looking good, right? She's looking nice. You're thinking to yourself, hey, hey girl, what up? Kind of looking for a date. We go out tonight. We can go by and get some, uh, some something to eat. You know, see what up, talk a little bit, see what happens, a little whatever. Anyway, let's see what happens. So here's what I'm doing. Cap of alcohol this time. Mm. And instead of spraying it like normal, like a maniac, Erica, this is the thing, the detail I put into it with the alcohol. I'm going to do it with this, a little tip thing. And I'm going to attempt to kind of paint it. But this is an alcohol brush. Will it work? Find out next time on Tainting with Four. No, I don't know. I have no idea if this will work. That's why we're going to... Uh, he's my dad. <laughs> That's why we're going to find out if this actually works or not. I don't know. God, I hope so. But I don't know. So we're going to start down here and see how much we fuck up first. Oh, sexy fish lady. All right, yeah. So uh, we know it'll smudge it around and it'll do that little number. So we already got that going. We already know it's going to do that. Okay, we can also maybe pull it out. No, we can't. There's no pulling that away. Okay, 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 okay. So we know it's possibly a giant clusterfuck already of purple. We know it's going to be a lot of purple. Oh, you know what I could do? I could use it as like an eraser maybe. No. May oh, maybe. Maybe as an eraser. Very light. Oh, God. Maybe. Ooh, why do you do these things to me? Why do you hate me so much? Okay. No, not really. Okay. We're kind of tweaking it a little bit, maybe. 
I don't know how I feel about this so far. I just do not know. Um, not quite going as planned, but then again, it might go better the more I do it. I don't know. Maybe these aren't big enough, so they won't supply me with quite enough alcohol to work with. You know, at a time, I don't know. The problem I'm seeing is there's a lot of the black that comes off at a time and just smudges down. So, oh, you know what? Maybe if I, uh, paper napkin. <laughs> Maybe I can wipe it down. Okay. Well, that takes away some of the detail, but then it kind of blurs some of the detail. Maybe I could rework it. I like the way you work it. No diggity. It got to burn, got to burn it up. Yeah, kind of like that. It, it's actually kind of working decently there. Don't know how it's going to work up there. Um, probably not so well, to be honest. Like, I can understand how that might function here. As a possibility. And if you could maybe let's dab it and see how that looks. All right, all right, all right. See, here's what we're kind of looking at right now. Not the shabbiest, not the worst. I can see its potential. I can see the potential in what's happening here. Kind of pulling it out like a watercolor-ish, but it's really dark. That concerns me. The darkness concerns me. Usually I love going dark, but my problem is, is I don't know how it's going to turn out. So I'm you know, just kind of scared a little bit of the dark. The dark scares me a little bit. I'm going with the, uh, with the curvature of all the pieces. So when something kind of says, hey, this is the way I'm working, I kind of run with it and then, you know, take my little thing here and dab that off. Dab that off. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. This might kind of work, maybe. Maybe. Now I can just use this tip. Oh, yeah, yeah, the tip coming back in and, uh, like, redrawing some of the lines. I can see that kind of working. You can shadow that in pretty good. That'll give it some interesting depth. Oh, man, but I don't know. Let's switch out real quick. On camera, it looks great. Well, thanks. I'm glad it looks... Oh, God, Jesus! They just fell all over the place. Don't worry, my dog will eat them. Anyway, let's try... I'm going to go with a little paddle brush one, only because it's new. So anyway, but here's what it looks like. Mm, yeah, one more time doing this method. So we're going to see how this, uh, I'm going for the whole thing. Again, it'll look really complex down here, but this right here is going to look very bland and blank, and then this will look very complex. So this is going to be overall kind of an awkward look when it comes down to it. And what I might end up doing is, when it's all said and done, I might try to hit it again with a little bit of alcohol to give it a... I don't know. I don't know. I'm worried because if I give it a hit of alcohol and it all blurs down, it'll just ruin everything anyway. So got to definitely be careful about that. But like this part right here worries the shit out of me because I know it's going to lose all that detail. All that detail work right there. And... Yeah, we're just going to go with it for a second. Bring that around. Squiggly wiggly. Bring you back up. Squiggly wiggly. Hurry up and dab it the fuck off. See if we can pull it. Man, it's going to be weird because it's going to be one of those ones where if you don't get right up there on it to see the detail, you're not going to see the detail. So I'm... I'm definitely going to have to uh, reconfigure some stuff. But again, keep in mind, everybody, this is this is my my theory of this technique and this method. It's completely invented it, to my knowledge. And if somebody else says otherwise, fuck them, they're liars. And um, so 
not really. To my knowledge, I invented it. I don't know. I've never heard of anybody else doing it. So I don't know. Okay, I just completely pulled all that out. Now I'm going to have to like redraw it, basically, just with the colorations. Fuck me, that sucked. That was the dumbest shit I've ever done. So glad I did that. That was awesome. But that's not doing too bad. I can do it. All right. Peanuts. Peanuts? Paint, paint it. I am painting it right now. Thank you. You're welcome. That's my slave driver. Mm. The alcohol really scares me. No fucking shit. The alcohol's really scaring me, man. Like, are you kidding me, bro? Look at what's happening right now before my very fucking eyes. I'm not sure if it's good or bad. I'm not sure if this is actually working or if it's just working against me. You know? It's like, it's an amazing idea and an amazing technique, and it could come out with some potentially great stuff. But at the same time, it's like, is it though? I mean, is it coming out with anything good or is it just like a fucking clusterfuck? I don't know. Because it kind of pulls colors out, but at the same time, it can push colors in, you know? So my whole theory is up in the air here about what I can and can't do with this stuff. And I'm really working at trying to figure it out. But I'm honestly, Erica, I'm, I'm at a question myself. Oh, fuck, I fucked up the teeth. I can tell you that. But I am going to go back over this one with some paint. Keep in mind also. So if anything, maybe I'll fix it that way. Because <laughs> it does have some really good, really unique quality and potential to it. It is, but not on this one. What? The potential? Oh, holy crap. This is so hot. I'm hard saying, yee, aw, ye the tip. <laughs> Wait, your dog. Wait, what are you doing? That's my mom said when I came out. Did you go to school for art? Sweet baby Jesus, this is a lot to pack in here. Hold on a second. First of all, looked night. Uh, Wait, my dog. Okay. I waited for my dog. Nothing. Second, this dead caricature. Did I go to school for art? No. No, I didn't. I mean, I went to like regular public school when I was in high school and shit. And uh, again, the classic story is my teacher hated me. Good times. Good times. Uh, great woman, as a matter of fact. Um, and I do like her and I highly appreciate her attempting to teach me. But I was a punk ass and I didn't listen. Good, it's shit. <laughs> good, good. I'm glad it's poop. Uh, you didn't, wow. Yeah, no, well, thank you. Looked, uh, and that's a little bit more close up of what it's turning out to kind of go with, with what I'm doing here. And there we go on that. So, anyway, to the dead caricature school that is. Oh, okay, my art. I thought you were saying, I was like, dude, you can't troll me, bro. Trust me. Because uh, I have such low self-esteem that you can't even imagine dipping that low to get to me. To make me feel bad. <laughs> Believe it. But school's not shit. They don't teach you how to be an adult or grow up or actually live life. But I'm sure they have a reason for something, right? <laughs> School. No, I really... I'm, I'm, I have mixed... Oh, my God. What? Everybody does hate school, sweetie. School is a complicated oh, craziness of weird stuff. What? What or what? Ew. Oh, those fell down out of my thing. Yeah, so why don't you skedaddle? Out of my business. My market's right here because I'm using them. Get about my business, yo. I want to paint myself. You're in my business, yo. I want to paint myself. Dab it a little bit. Try to pull off some of that. Would you get out of here? <laughs> Anyway, school it is making you want to, to die. School or my painting? Because uh, school's not bad. Like, it's where your friends are at and life. Dude, when you grow up, 
like I know all the old people are always like, you better enjoy these years now. They're the best years of your life. Because when you grow up, it's like school, only um, stupider. Because you don't really get to see your friends anymore. You think you're going to. And then your friends get married. And they have kids. And they have a life. And they have jobs. And you have jobs. And you have kids. And you have a life. Then you get divorced. And then you get married again. And they have more kids. And you have. It's just, dude, it's a never ending cycle of life. And then you wake up one day when you're 45 and you go, huh. Fuck, those were the best years of my life, weren't they? I'm not 45 yet. I haven't reached that point, but I know it's happening. And you're going to go, huh. And then you tell your own kids. Man, enjoy the days because uh, they're the best years of your life. And your kids go, shut up, old man. You're done. And then they throw dog poop in your mouth. God damn, they have good aim. But until then, dude, you're on the ball. Just keep up with it. Hang out there. Enjoy it. I'm not saying you'll learn a lot of shit because, I mean, school didn't teach me a goddamn thing about real life. That's for certain. School is just like, well, here's how you do this and do that. And I'm like, cool, but I suck at math, bro. I am dumb as fuck. Why are you teaching me this stuff? I'll never remember it. And they're like, well, one day you might be an electrical engineer. And I'm like, <laughs> like, bro, one day I might be an electrical engineer. Dude, who the fuck do you think you're talking to? It's amazing. I know how to tie my fucking shoes in the morning. God damn. What kind of high hopes you got for me, man? Like, I mean, I guess one day I might be an electrical engineer if every single other electrical engineer on the planet died and they had to say randomly, any, mini miny, that guy, you know, then sure. Maybe I would be an electrical engineer. Cool, bro. Nice story, yo. But otherwise, nah, I ain't gonna. That's a little bit out of my league, yo. To my knowledge, everybody in my school that ever needed to learn math pretty much works at McDonald's. So it's kind of like, uh, you know, they didn't need to learn algebra. They just need to learn one plus one is uh, your change is 375. Please drive through. So, and I ain't bashing them. Too real. Thanks. I ain't bashing them at all, bro. I mean, McDonald's is a shit job, but every job's a shit job. Every job is a shit fucking job. Let's be honest. All right. No, no lying. Nobody wants to fucking work for their life. They just want to party and have a good old fucking time. You know, that's what life's supposed to be, right? Party, party, party. But responsibility. Got to have it, right? Got to do it, right? That's life, right? Yeah, I guess it kind of fucking is, isn't it? I guess it fucking is, isn't it? But, I mean... That's why you make the best of it, you know? School is fun with your friends. Because once you get out of it, you'll you'll miss them. They're gone. At first, nah, at first it's okay. At first you'll see them a couple of times. You may go party a little bit. School's out, man. Let's go party. Woo! We're being fucking dumb fuckers. Cool, bro. But it'll quit. It'll quit real quick. And all the fucking good times are gone, and all the parties are gone, and all the bullshit's gone. I never partied. I was a fucking nerd. Nobody liked me, and nobody invited me to their parties. Fuck all you guys. And um, that's okay. I don't hold it against them. I understand. I wasn't one of the cool kids. But come back here, napkin. All right, throw that one away. Oh, you're outside my house? Bro, no, you're not. I have guard dogs the size of human fucking beings. If you're outside my house right now, your name dead right there would be a little bit more accurate. I'm not joking. You ask my son if you don't believe me, because I'm sure you know him since you're uh, Connor's friend there, I guess. Because he said your friends, sorry, your friends are retarded. And I'm assuming he's talking about you, bro. I mean, I don't know. I'm not calling you retarded. Unless you're retarded, then I'll call you retarded because, you know, I let people know what up. But if you're not retarded, just ignore that. <laughs> and if you are retarded, well, then I'm not calling you, like, retarded. Because I don't make fun of people who are, are retarded. Just people who are being retarded. Ugh, that face kind of came out Yankee. Yankee? That ain't even a word, bro. I make up my own words, man. And I say bro. I, I say bro ironically, though. Bro. Ah, oh, fuck. Stop doing that, you dumb fuck. Napkin. Napkin. Nope. Whew. 
okay. So it's getting weird. The dark purple, it's got a unique look to it. It's definitely not looking like it's magic marker. You know, like if you saw it overall, you would not go, oh, hey, that part's magic marker. You know, it's pulling away from that feeling, which is great. The bad thing is dead isn't from Cushing. She, oh, she's in a different town an hour away. Tonight is one of mine and the best friends. Oh, okay. Well, so that's fine. Ugh. But man, all right. So uh, these fucking allergies are fucking kicking my ass. <sighs> kind of got me skirt, Erica. I know you're worried about the uh you were worried about the uh the alcohol ink combination here. I was too, and now I can definitely see why. You've got weird friends. No, you don't, bro. You just got friends, man. I mean, you guys are all young, punk-ass kids, I guess, or whatever, right? So, unless one of your friends is like 35, in which case, that's just kind of weird that you guys are all hanging out together anyway. Not necessarily true, though, because I'm like one of the coolest fucking old people on the planet. So, you know. Uh, just saw your ad for the Winchester. Can't wait. Oh, yeah, yeah. We have, like, my, my film... It's going to be actually uh, shown at a drive-in theater coming up this month. And everybody keeps hitting me up about that. So, Oh, the ghost of my buttered pig still lives. Nice. No, no, no. Uh, you know there, clown, we miss you, dude. And we do uh, talk about you once in a while. So, <laughs> Nah, dude, we miss you, man. You should come back and play with us. If you get a PlayStation 5, you're going to actually play with us, right? You're not just going to, like, ignore us. I mean, you'll update your profile. You'll update your new system and shit like that. And you'll have all your old games on it. So, right? Okay. Even weird for your school standard? Hmm. Well, then, they probably would have been, like, you know, my home slices back in the day. I had a bunch of... Nah, I didn't really have weird friends. Yeah, I had a weird... I was the weird kid in school, though, being honest. I was, like, the weird kid in school. Okay. Here's the dilemma. Here's what I'm seeing, Erica. Uh, and I talked to Erica specifically because she's always uh, stream on Twitch. I should, but here's the problem. I can't stream on Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, all of it at the same time. If I could do a YouTube and Twitch at the same time thing, and I do stream on Twitch. Actually, if you go to uh, – good. Uh, I do stream on Twitch, but it's all my gaming bullshit. Um, but it's uh, just forward slash God in a machine. So look up God in a machine on Twitch, and that's a bunch of dumb shit that we – do me and my, my gaming gang which clown here is one of but he's not on it anymore we shunned him from the group since he lost his playstation shunned we speak not of his name any longer hmm. but uh no erica i'm worried about this this alcohol method also only because of how dark it makes it so maybe if we lighten up on the amount placed in there because i didn't know how this would work with all my other inks, you know, they come out kind of, you know, what consoles do I play? Oh, PS4. That's it. Ah, just PS4. So, sorry, on PS4, it's uh, God in a Machine. On on PS4 and then on my Twitch, it's also only from God in a Machine on the PS4 stuff, so. But, uh... Nah, the Xbox freaks me out, man, when they were like, oh, it's got to be online all the time, and it watches you sleep. I'm like, no, I'm cool with that not watching me sleep. So, yeah, thanks. But then they were like, oh, no, no, we didn't mean that. We, we It doesn't have to be online. I'm like, mm, I can't trust you anymore. So, mm, nope, Xbox all the way, or uh, PlayStation all the way. Xbox officially makes me feel like they're going to watch me. They're just going to turn it on when I'm not looking and shit. And you're like, what you doing, Eric? I'm like, no, no, what? Did my Xbox just ask me what I was doing? They're like, I don't need this kind of shit from you, Xbox. I don't need this kind of shit from you. <sighs> All right. So the highlighting aspect of this is what's really hard. Because it's almost strict, strictly using magic. All I'm doing using, by the way, the FBI is wired in through your headset. I don't doubt it, and they've heard a lot of fucking weird shit from me. 
They hear a lot of weird shit from me anyway, bro. Not even worried about that. Um, here's the thing. This being magic marker and alcohol, right? My own method. I, I'm going to say that every time. My own method. Just so people fucking know I invented the method. But it being something new and interesting to work with, I'm still, I'm still tweaking the bugs. I'm figuring out a lot. There's no highlighting to it. This is strictly going from dark to, or light to dark. So the less is more is definitely applicable here because when you start trying to pull the color out, you just erase the lines, period. Dude, the new PlayStation update is recording party chats and shit. Well, I'm not so paranoid about it now. I just don't want them like turning on the camera and watching me while I'm sitting there dancing around in a chicken suit or anything fucking weird that I do on my spare time, you know? That's the thing. I mean, they can record our party chats. They're not going to hear anything stupid except for us, like, yelling at each other and saying really dumb shit, you know? So that isn't nearly as bad. It's just whenever I think they're going to be, like, watching me when I'm not wanting them to. If they're turning on my shit for me, not cool, bro. Not cool at all, bro. You know? Not cool at all. Oh, man, that's way too much. See, I put that dark patch right there, kind of thinking, all right, cool. Where the fuck am I? Thinking, all right, cool. We'll put that there. My fucking napkin. Oh, it's in my fat gut. I thought my fucking... You know, that kind of does work to pull it up, though. Just going back over it like that a little bit, and then... Pulling up, but it also erases those lines. You gotta be real careful with how you work it. So, oh shit, definitely gonna keep that in mind. Hmm. Uh, have I heard about the new Xbox, the Xbox fridge? Okay, now you're just being retarded. But, uh, cause I know that's not a real thing. I mean, I don't know that, oh, fuck my butt. I don't know that's not a real thing, but I'm assuming that's not a real thing. But the fact that the Xbox is also huge, like a big block of crap, I'm assuming it's just made up to be. You know, funny because the Xbox is huge and dumpy and, you know, like a big old block. <laughs> now, oh shit, biscuits. The thing is, you got to be really careful how much purple you pull out of that black to use the fucking highlight for anything. Jesus Christ. This is rough because it is definitely a less is more thing here. That is for sure. Less is goddamn more. Uh, I just don't want them to catch me on my Sasquatch antics and be caught real quick. Yeah, that's true. Future reference, my buddy Clown is a legitimate Sasquatch. And nobody thinks that I'm... I mean, people think I'm kidding, but I'm not. They turned it into a computer. No, it looks like a fridge. They turned it into a computer. It's no longer a console. So in other words, PS4 won the console wars. Oh, I get it. They gave up. That's because Xbox sucks. And they're like, we can't compete anymore. We're garbage. Like, yeah, you are. Give up. I got a buddy of mine who uh, is a huge Xbox guy, and he's always doing the Xbox war with me, where he's always telling me how much garbage uh, PlayStation is, you know, and how much better Xbox is, yada, yada, you know, the usual war stuff. So I'll have to uh, tell him that one. I'll be like, oh, look who won the war. What makes this interesting and weird is I was going to make her flesh toned at first, but now it looks like I'm going to have to go with a light purple. Hmm. Mm, interesting. Everybody in this is going to be purple. Very weird. Very accidental. Very oops-a-daisy. I'll figure it out when I have to figure that out. As they say in film, I'll fix it in post. The great thing is, though, is you can go back over it and kind of scribble in new details or scribble out old details to blend it in better. So I like that. I like that a lot. That'll allow me a lot more, um, but I can't pull out. Oh, man, how am I going to throw that one away, get a new one? One of the other bad parts is, is use a lot of these. PS did win. You heard it from Bigfoot himself. Yeah, well, that's true. Uh, 
Well, it kind of makes sense because they drown and you turn purple and you can't breathe. No, I'm okay. Yeah. They're also dead rotting and flesh and all that. Well, you don't know they're, they're not dead yet. They're just melting into, see? It is a small one. It might be as high as my waist. Huh. Okay. Yesterday, I almost tried two of your cranberry juices and now she's drinking two more. Okay, that's fine. Cranberry juice is fine. I'm going to drink all of it. You can have some cranberry juice if you want it. Ariana is. But you can have some too if you want it. Exactly. No, no, what? no, no, no. Boobies have nipples. Now get away. That I, is anatomically I, correct. I don't allow that. That is anatomically correct. Go away. I don't allow that. I don't allow. Well, you cannot allow it, but I'm doing it. Now get away. So that's how you do it. That's how I'm doing this, yeah. All right, you know what? I can pull up color again, as I was doing earlier with the with this. So we're going to keep doing that. Really? Hi, I'm making a watermelon. You're making a watermelon? I'm making a watermelon. All right, make a watermelon. Yay. That's fine. Uh, oh, and they're also dead. No, yeah, again, yeah, you know. So, yeah, I can pull out, pull up a little bit. It's just it's not very, it's just not very uh, practical to try to pull it up so much. It's much easier to blend in that darkness, the darkness. Prepare for the darkness. Kind of shit. Anyway, now let me kind of, I got a really good face down here that I don't want to lose in this mess of shit. But, I mean, it's got a cool effect. I'm definitely not too disappointed with the effect. I fear, however, this part of the effect. Because this is going to be very white and blank. I don't want it to be very white and blank. I want it to be a purplish to match, but I don't want to use paint. It's going to be real hard to blend that alcohol like that. It's going to be real hard to blend that booby. I don't know. Can you buy this? I mean, you can if you want to. I, all my work is for sale, technically, yes. Uh, Give me some of these things free. That's good. Yeah, but you're my daughter. <laughs> but yes. Uh, I have He's giving out free painting. No. I do have an Etsy by technicality, but keep in mind I am a professional artist. I have actually had gallery showings and things of that nature. So a lot of my work, you know, is on a legitimate scale, you so to speak, not to sound you like... Look, I made a watermelon. You did make a watermelon. I made... Oops. I, <laughs> I made watermelon. She made a watermelon. There's a fly going in my eye. But there is a fly. I don't know why the... Uh, anyway... <laughs> Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. But this is all practice of technique and ideas and methods and I'm gonna keep on painting my nails. Somewhere. Theories that I've had or techniques and ideas that I'm doing and then uh, trying them. I swear to god fly. Cool, I had some art in a thing before. Uh, I don't know if that watermelon would taste good though. And I'm not by any means, I'm just saying like uh, you know, I'm not on a, I'm on a professional level. I will end up selling this in my Etsy because Etsy is where I put my stuff. Uh, if it doesn't go into a gallery for any reason, which this one's not. I don't have anything gallery coming up for a long time. The COVID thing kind of killed a lot of us artists in a lot of ways for a lot of stuff for a while. And I haven't even worried about gallery showings in a minute, so I'm not worried about it. But my Etsy is actually real easy. It's X Art of Horror, so go look that up. And there's a whole bunch of my shit there, too. But yeah, that's where, if you're seriously interested, this will probably pop up soon. Or you can uh, instant message me. But uh, you probably don't have my instant message. And I don't just accept friend requests on uh, Facebook from people I don't know. So if I don't honestly know you, I really won't uh, generally do that. But... There are ways to get at me. You'll just have to find people who know me <laughs> and have them hit me up or something, you know? Because otherwise it's awkward. I guess I could add you. I just don't know who you are. 
So I don't know what your demeanor is or your overall uh, attitude in life is and things like that. So I don't want something weird where you come at me like being a complete jerk or anything, you know? I mean, I don't know you. Just don't, you know, you know, that's just me being straight up with you. I don't know you, man. I've had people that were like, hey, man, what's up? And I'm like, hey, what's up? And then they went crazy on me. I'm like, you need to calm down. So ever since then, I've been like, I don't know you, bro. That's not my purse. And uh, so got to be uh, got to be got to be on guard about craziness these days, man. The world is crazy these days. Holy crap. I've already been on for like an hour. Oh, uh, really fly. God. He's like my new he's like my painting buddy. Oh, my God. And this goes back to Erica here, which I don't know if she's watching right now, but uh, Bob Ross had a pet squirrel. Apparently, I have a pet fly. That's the best. It's so awesome. So glad. Thanks, Fly, for being my pet buddy, my art buddy. Okay. Don't edit this guy pretty well. Lots of alcohol on him. Pulling his, his coloration out really decently. Just quick strokes to make sure it gets out of him. I'm sitting this down here. I have watermelon fingers. Now I want to eat them. Uh, okay, you go eat your watermelon fingers. It's fine. I'm eating pizza. You're eating pizza. Okay, good job. Oh, no, 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 no. Look at his face. Look at his eyeballs. They totally screwed up. Oh, my God. How would that have even fucking happened? Oh, fuck my, my butthole. Come on, dude. What the fuck is wrong with you, you piece of fucking garbage? Oh, my fuck. God, Jesus Christ. Why the fuck are you even a fucking thing, you fuck ass? Oh, come fucking on. Please, baby, God, Jesus almighty, fucking don't do this garbage to me, you fuck. Actually, that is not too bad. That actually looks kind of cool now that I've started uh, tweaking it and trying to save it. It looks kind of blah, 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 grotesque and weird. Okay, I can deal with that. Never mind. I'm not so angry about it now that I've actually you know, fucked with it a little bit and made it kind of tweaky. And... Yeah, okay. All right, all right. I'm not too dissatisfied. Let's just... They're kind of cartoonish, though. I need to do something with them because they're way too cartoonish. He is. He's like, ha. Oh. Ah, I'm fucking dumb. What is my Etsy? Uh, go to go to Etsy and then just type in X, the letter X, X, art of horror, and that's my Etsy. And uh, it'll be a picture of me. Well, okay, this is weird because this is the only time you'll ever see this. Yeah, I don't do this thing i uh i hate this so i actually have my own face and so the etsy's actually 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 the etsy picture is of one of my gallery showings where i'm just sitting on like a couch and you'll see some of my art behind me uh in a gallery showing we had but uh not too shabby overall i'm a little worried about the nipple nips mm, a little worried about the nippy nips now your beard and mustache is beautiful the way it is. No, 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 no. It's not that. It's just, ugh. Oh. Hate this. Dig that. Hate that. But that's because I didn't do anything with the eyes yet. Maybe I should just do stuff with the eyes. Fix those because I didn't tweak either one of them's eyes or mouths. And now that I'm looking at them, his eyes are pretty cool. Here, let me give you a better example of what I'm talking about. There's the... Uh, See, he's came out pretty decent. I still gotta fuck with him a little bit, but that one looks ridiculously bad. That one looks bit. Same thing over here. He came out pretty good there. I gotta fix the nose a little bit, but that one's ridiculously bad, and that one's it. So, give me a second. Keep in mind, this is yesterday was an accident. Uh, this was came from the idea of, hey, you guys tell me what to paint. Or what to doodle out, and I'll doodle it. And this is what everybody, well, okay, it's not what everybody suggested. 
originally it was supposed to be uh, Hot Rod and Jesus with a, a six pack and some hot chicks. And I was like, all right, maybe, but. Yeah, the dogs got let out. All of them? Nope. I can't Ch work here, Chainsaw man. noodles. I have to get my dog too. So he has to come out too. And okay, to chainsaw go. and noodles? Yep. Yeah, whenever she's bringing the pizza in the gate. Pizza gate. Who's who's who brought the pizza in the gate? Kyra. Okay. I was just curious. Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, old people, young space aliens, and everybody in between, I apparently have to go get my goddamn dog, which, by the way, is the size of a fucking human being. And will literally eat your face. That's why her name's Chainsaw. She might come back in on her own. Hang on. She's a good dog. Like that sometimes. Okay, yeah, that looks pretty good. Might be able to. But yeah, I'm gonna have to go get her. Did she come back in? No. No. Oh. Shit. Well, shit, biscuits. Looks like I'm gonna have to go do my thing. What breed? Oh, Rottweiler, a pit bull hybrid. And uh, she's a big girl. Uh oh, I hear her barking. Oh, shit. Gotta go. Anyway, live's over for today. I'll see you guys ooh, tomorrow. We'll finish this bad boy up. Let me, uh, okay. Oh, you just popped in the wrong.